We will never meet, but I know your body better than my own. I've held your heart in my hands and cut straight through your bone. I've traced every last one of your nerves, arteries, and veins. You've taught me so much, but I still do not know your name. On your face, I discovered the muscles that allowed you to smile. And I dreamed about the things that made you happy for a while. I opened your lacrimal sack and thought about the tears you've cried. Then I shed some myself. Not everything I own smells like formaldehyde. As I peeled the skin back from your palms to see the tissue beneath, I knew I'd be the last one to hold your hand while observing what was embedded in the sheath. On the shores of your calcarine fissure, my finger traced the path of all your sights. And I wondered about the things you saw, how you spent your days and your nights. I know nothing about your life, your work, your family, or your death. But I have passed a probe through each of your bronchi that produced 95 years of breath. And although I'll never have the privilege of hearing you speak, you taught me to understand both by connecting you back to your primitive streak. You've showed me how expectations can sometimes prove the rule. And helped me learn that reverse scissoring is my favorite tool. The gift that you've given me to discover through dissection is an honor in which I have given much reflection. Looking inside you helped me to see myself in a new way. I've learned from you and it's a debt I cannot repay. You taught me more than structures and the names of each feature. They said you're my first patient. I prefer to call you my teacher.